Hello students, my name is Rajman Hendik, Assistant Professor, Assam Dantran University. Today I am here to discuss with you all about the concept of pub, uh, public health. So be before moving forward, let us discuss what is health, what do you mean by health? So as defined by the World Health Organization in, the, in 1948, uh, health is a state of complete physical, mental and social well-being and is not merely the absence of disease or infirmity. The World Health Organization has also stated that the health is the extent to which an individual or a group is able to realize aspirations, satisfy needs and to change or cope with the environment so now we move forward that is what is public health so in in layman's term you can say public health is the health measures are the health measures that is directed to a group of people rather than uh, yeah, rather than uh, individual to promote, protect and preserve health. So the public health may be conceptualized as analyzing the health of a population and the threats it faces is the basis of for public health. The science of protecting the safety and improving the health of communities through education policy ma making and research for the disease and injury prevention now let's see the different definitions of a public health as defined by charles edward amory winslow in 1928 public health is the science and the art of preventing disease prolonging life and promoting health and efficiency through organized community effort through organized community effort for the sanitation of the environment the control of communicable infections the education of the individuals in personal hygiene the organization of medical and nursing services for the early diagnosis and prevention, preventive treatment of disease and the development of the social machinery to ensure everyone a standard of living adequate for, main, for, adequate for maintenance of health. So organizing these benefits as to enable every citizen to realize his birthright of health and longevity. A public health specialist and clinician in the medical field clinician treats disease and injuries of one patient at a time but in public health we prevent disease and injury public health researchers practitioners and educators work with communities and population they identify the cause of disease and disability and implement large-scale solution for example instead of treating a gunshot wound we uh, they work to identify the cause of gun violence and develop interventions instead of treating premature or low birth weight babies we inve they investigate the factors at work and develop program to keep babies healthy instead of prescribing medic medication for high blood pressure they examine examine the links among obesity diabetes and heart disease and and use their data to influence policy aimed at reducing all three conditions in public health microbiologists work 
to find a vaccine for malaria while behavioral scientist researchers research ways to discourage populations from smoking. Environmental health scientists work to discover which foods prevent cancer while health policy analyzed, analyze, evaluate health insurance program and make recommendations. And epidemiologists identify trends in health and illness, looking for links, causes and intervention in areas such as HIV AIDS, tuberculosis and infant mortality. So, so, in, uh, so generally speaking, popul uh, public health is population based, emphasized collectively responsibility for health, its protection and disease prevention, recognize the key role of the state linked to a concern for the underlying socio-economic and wider determine determinants of health as well as disease. Emphasis partnerships with all those who contribute to health of the population. Next we have, next we will discuss about the different components of, uh, of public health. So public health is an inter interdisciplinary field that includes epidemiology, biostatistics, management of health services, environmental health, community health, behavioral health, health economics, public policy, mental health, occupational safety, gender issues in health, and sexual and reproductive health. Next we have uh, the different dimensions of public health. The different dimensions of public health are health education, health promotion, health protection, disease prevention, early diagnosis and prompt treatment, disability limitation and rehabilitation. So the different activities related to public health are prevents epidemics, protects the environment, workplace, housing, food and water, monitors health status of the population, mobilizes community action, responds to disaster, assures quality accessibility and accountability of medical care, reaches out to link high risk and hard to reach people to needed services, researches to develop new insights and innovative solutions, leads the development of sound health policy and plan. So here we can see the different components of public health. The different components of public health are social medicine, preventive medicine, community medicine and community health. So in conclusion, I like to say, is, uh, say that the public health is a dynamic field of medicine that is concerned primarily with, the, uh, with improving the health of the population rather than just the health of individuals. So with this, I have come to an end to my presentation. Thank you.